Hi there, my name is Coach Ramona and I work for America's Forest Cleveland and I'm going to give you guys some ideas of ways to stay active and healthy during this time away from the program. Before you do any of the challenges over the next week, make sure you ask permission first and find a safe area that you can use. So to start with, we're going to talk about quick feet because it's really important in soccer and lots of other sports that you're able to move your feet around quickly to adjust during a game. So some of you might have used ladders before, they can be really fun, but you don't actually need a ladder to do the same exercises. I'm going to show you a couple just using the lines on the slats of this porch. I'll show you slow and then I'll try and show you quick as well. So one to start with is going to be two feet forward and two feet back. So you go right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. And if you could try and speed up, that's amazing. Another really good one you could do in the same space is your feet together. So now I'll be hopping forward and hopping backward. That's another great one if you can speed it up and do it over and over for a period of time, you'll really, really help with your foot skills. Now we're going to get a ball because that's everybody's favorite part. Some of you have probably done this before and we're just going to start out with simple toe taps. That means you're touching the top of the ball, alternating feet, just like this. If you can, pick a spot on your ball to try and hit every time so the ball doesn't really move. When you're ready, try and speed it up. That's a great activity to do for about 30 to 45 seconds just to get yourself warmed up. Another similar activity involves playing the ball back and forth between your feet, almost like you're passing to yourself. So I go with my right, then my left. A great way to measure how you're doing on that and whether or not you've improved is if you're moving forward or backwards. If you're staying in the same small area, that is fantastic. It's a really important part of soccer is to feel comfortable with the ball at your feet. So those are great warm-ups, but don't be afraid to start moving around. So the other part of your foot that I want to talk about today is the bottom. So you're just going to practice doing some rolls. I can roll this way. I can roll this way. I can go forward. Or I can go backwards. That bottom part of your foot is so important in soccer because it means your ball is protected and you can move it easily depending on what you want to do. So now, or whenever you have time, see if you can practice rolling the ball around in whatever area you've got. No matter what, stay safe and have fun.